Yo, how's it going guys? It is Camden here, back with another video here on Camden Plays. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about how to get unlimited sand dollars here during Summerfest, guys. If you did not know, you get sand dollars and you can buy some awesome stuff. But right before we get started, make sure to go down below and like and subscribe because at 5k subs, I'm giving away another free Prodigy Epic to any of my subscribers. All you have to do is subscribe, so go down below. Hit that subscribe button, and yeah, let's begin. Alrighty guys, so there's two different methods to getting these sand dollars, and most of these methods literally will allow you to get unlimited. Meaning you can do this a million times, or you can literally do this as many times as you want, and you will still be able to get the sand dollars every time you do it. Meaning you can literally basically get unlimited sand dollars 100% for free. Now the first method is going every single day and finding one of these little monsters that steal food. Food. Now, this part is not as good as the second reason, which I'm going to be talking about later, but this gives you 10 sand dollars every time you do it. Now, I'm going to explain to you guys how you basically can do this. So first, you want to go ahead and just walk around and try to find a monster that is guarding basically the sand dollars. You are going to see a little exclamation above his head, I believe, and you can just spot him out against all the other things. It's going to be like an obvious little monster. Usually, I'm pretty sure it's an Apollot, for those of you who are wondering. Now, you can actually find this guy, and if you battle him, you will be able to get 10 sand dollars for free so there you go guys as you can see he's right here i'm gonna do the battle just for demonstrations in this video and i'll be showing you guys essentially how to get this now as you can see all you have to do is do this little quick battle with him so i'm just gonna do it real fast while we're in the middle of this battle check and make sure that you have subscribed guys so go down below hit that subscribe button guys it really does help me out now these battles are honestly pretty easy they don't take that long to complete and of course yeah i mean <laughs> he doesn't really do that much damage either so we're just going to go ahead and answer these questions make sure you get these questions correct that will probably help make the process go faster but all you have to do is just answer them and boom we just defeated the apple lot and watch what happens once we finish this battle guys giving us the sign that we won we just won the battle and it is going to go ahead and give us in this little chest i do have to open i do have to get the member stars first all right of course of course we have to get the member stars but after we gain the member stars open this chest and it's going to give you 10 sand dollars so that is probably one of the best methods to getting sand dollars and you can do this every single day meaning you can literally get unlimited i mean you can do this as many days in a row as you want you can do it every day so just set out every single day to do it now the second way is truly unlimited because there is actually no limit on how many times you can do it and that is just going to a certain area on the map and doing battles if you guys did not know in battles in the chest you actually have a chance of getting sand dollars meaning if you do enough battles you can get sand dollars from those chests and just keep doing it get unlimited sand dollars guys and it's gonna be great now which places do I recommend I recommend going to the Academy just because the battles are pretty fast and you don't really have to complete quests and stuff and also crystal caverns both of those areas are really good but once you go into a battle you can actually win that battle and once you you win you can get the possibility of getting sand dollars now those are basically the two reasons right so what are my tips number one make sure you are battling every single day if you want a chance at getting all the rewards in the middle now if you go over to the middle here just to show you guys really fast from athena and stuff like this everything that you're going to be buying during Summerfest comes from these sand dollars so it is extremely important that if you want these you need to do the methods that i taught in this video and also just every single day that you guys are battling Go ahead, go around, try to find that guy, try to find that monster, and go ahead and defeat him, and you will get yourself 10 sand dollars every time. Now, right before we end the video, make sure you are subscribed, because again, at 5k subs, I'm doing a free epic giveaway. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the tips I gave you in this video. So go ahead, go get yourself some unlimited sand dollars. Make sure to battle in these two areas, okay? Crystal Caverns is very important. I'm, I'll just show you guys really quick right now.
go to crystal caverns you can battle some of these monsters it will be super fast and also go to the academy as well just go down here start a little start like enter the archives start a little quest and you can go ahead and fight monsters but yeah guys that is going to wrap up this video thank you so much for watching if any tips helped you let me know down below in the comments and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out